Hey, what's going on guys? Coming again is here. Finally, a new updated version of BBC 1.3 with uh, Stockfish and NUE is available to be played online on on my site at pythonanywhere.com So, um, you can now uh, fill the experience of how to play versus uh, Stockfish and NUE just right in the browser. So, so like it's not an opening book, which you might wonder it is, but it's not actually. So he plays this like from from his uh, NNE brains, if you want to say it like that. So it's quite pretty exciting already. And even sometimes uh, it's going for some different openings. Uh, again, like another very cool feature of NNE itself. So you can play kind of various games. So I think that's beneficial at the very least. Another little improvement, uh, I've added this beautiful uh, logo for BBC Chess Engine created kindly by Brandon J. Norman. So Brandon, Brandon, if you're watching this video, thank you so much for providing this logo. And uh, you said like uh, beating BBC was a piece of cake for you. So I challenge you for yet another try because this version should be, well, at least at least two elo, uh, 200 elo points stronger compared to the previous one that you've been playing. And obviously for the best experience, uh, make sure to download the source code. So uh, it's available right over in here. And just click on the latest release and here it is. And don't forget to download the NNG file to actually make it uh, using it properly. Otherwise it won't be working correctly. So uh this is it basically so just change the, lay the layout for my email and the support button as well everything else is literally the same so just just try to give it a little bit more pretty and uh pretty look and just like something looks like the end result at the, uh, at the moment so still you can change the time control uh i mean like how, how long engine would be thinking so it's all about the same basically uh, obviously assuming that the free and uh, the free instance of amazon web server that is used by python anywhere is not really that fast for such a uh, for such a calculations like uh, engine actually does with neural networks it's they're really kind of heavy calculations there but anyway uh, this version is kind of capable of playing chess and I've just blundered, blundered the night, but that's not a big deal, obviously. As always, you can flip the board, take the moves back as long as you want, force computer to make the move itself. Also, you can, can keep track of depth, time, notes, and speed. Again, like the speed at the moment is about 65% uh, slower because of this and then you, uh, for, for those of you who don't know what this dot does this mean, this means efficiently updatable neural networks. So it's it takes uh, quite uh, quite a bit of computer processing power to actually calculate the evaluation using this neural network. That's the reason for slowing down the kilonauts per second parameter here. But anyway, uh, it plays now much more interesting chess. And again, like just feel free to download. Uh, the engine and try it uh, in UCI mode uh, on your favorite GUI because uh, anyway this online version just serves the purpose of a demo it's not kind of full-blown experience it's just it's just a demo okay guys so this is it from my side I hope you've enjoyed this video new tutorials are coming soon on chess programming channel by the way let me know in the commentaries if you would be interested in uh, watching the videos of me embedding uh, NNE from Stockfish to engines like TSCP and Weiss. Well, actually, uh, I'm personally really interested in doing that those sorts of an experiments because at the very least that would be fun, I believe. And uh, as far as I'm not using some fancy optimizations, uh, it won't be really that strong as Stockfish, obviously, and bearing in mind that even if you have an in in your engine still uh, without a fast search it actually does improve this plane strength significantly but again like with, uh, without the good search it, it's not really going that far so just another fact to bear in mind 
Okay, guys, so this is it from my side. Hope to see you in the next tutorials on this chess programming channel. Uh, on this chess programming channel. Until that time, and take care.